if you want to have a sovereign currency, it's up to the states and only to the states to be responsible for a sovereign currency. It's not the role and it should not be the role of a private company to try to get a sovereign currency like a sovereign state. So that's why I made very clear from the very beginning that we should not accept to have Libra being developed on the European territory. We have to uh, give some clear responses to the challenges posed by uh, the fact that there are some financial transactions that are too costly, that there is a question for uh, the efficiency of those financial transactions and we need to put some concrete proposals on the table, concrete responses to those challenges, but we do not want a private company to create a sovereign currency because I strongly believe that it would be a risk for the sovereignty of the states. There are also risks linked to the possibility uh, of having money laundering through this currency, the possibility of funding terrorism through this currency, but these are technical challenges and political challenges that we could address. But there is one challenge that we would not be able to address if we open the door to Libra, which is the question of sovereignty. A currency is a question of sovereignty, and sovereignty should remain in the hands of the states.